Season's greetings, everybody. Last game before the Christmas break. I'm James Sabalski. Always a festive time, and we are ready for a fun one tonight. Just moments away from puck drop, both teams seem ready to go. The Leafs start with possession as we are now underway. Boston's got the puck in their own end. Through center along the wing. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. The Leafs scoop it up along the boards. Johns works the puck in his own zone. And here's the pass to Marner. McAvoy's got it in the defensive end. The Bruins take it along the wing. A chance! Turns that one away. Through the neutral zone and into the offensive end. Turned aside with a glove by Omar. Lots of time left in this period. The game is still scoreless. The Bruins win it in the defensive zone. Up along the wing. James, he's only one goal away from the next plateau. He's really working the puck now. Angles it over to Voracek. The Leafs are in transition. Saucer feed. Stones him in front. Omar's had a lot to do with the team's winning record. His save percentage has been excellent all season. Can't make the connection on the pass. The Bruins gain control of the puck. Toronto's got control of it now from their own end. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Voracek. Toronto's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. There's the whistle as the play was offside. It's always a little strange when you see your buddies in the other sweater, the one that you used to wear. You've just got to step past that here in his first game against his former team. Taves wins it in the neutral zone. Slick feed. Takes it to the net. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Omar. Rita, the play was perfect, but it's his quickness that gets out tight to the puck so the shooter can't elevate it anywhere. There's nowhere for the puck to go. Moves the puck across to Latang. The Bruins take possession in the neutral zone. And that's broken up. Toronto's got the puck. Taken along the wall by Tees. Right up the gut into the offensive end. The Leafs gain possession along the wall. Through center. The Bruins take possession in the defensive end. Boston's in now. Frederick's got it along the wing. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. Picked up along the wall by Coyle. He just got rattled by that big hit. Slowly, he's kind of meandering to the bench. They got to get the door open for him and help him get into the bench to get looked out. Quick feed to Frederick. The Bruins move it ahead. Moves it to DeBrus. Oh, what a kick save. Tremendous athleticism on the play. Slides across in the butterfly to make the save, but you still have to be agile, even though you're covering the bottom of the net. And now it's grabbed by Johns. Turns that chance aside. But really clicking here in the offensive end. All sorts of pressure. Dishes to Matthews. Picked off. And they'll skate it out of the zone. Look at this. They've got some bodies here on the attack. Chris's gonna opt for the whistle and give everybody a chance to breathe. Sometimes you get running around as the shift gets long. This helps. Greer's been in some discomfort since he took this hit. A clean hit right through the body. Chris is well respected and a great competitor between the pipes. McAvoy's able to steady his team defensively and still contribute points. Let's see if one of these stars can give their team the upper hand in this matchup. Back to you now. Oh, and he just puts it wide of the net. Huge steal at his own end. Bunting's got it along the boards. 
And now he tries to get it across to Kerfoot. The Bruins get a hold of the puck in their own end. Here they come up along the wing. Here we go, pucks in deep. Toronto's got the puck in the defensive end. Poked away yet centered by Pasternak. Dumps the puck in. Boston's got a hold of it along the wall. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Toronto's looking to break out of their own end. And now it's over to Kerfoot. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Saka. Can't find his man. Toronto's ready to go on the attack. Here's the pass. Scores! Well, we know it'll be a Merry Christmas in their household after that view. Toronto's hustle the difference here as they take a 1-0 lead. Been so hard to get any open space on the ice. You work, work, work. There's nothing there. Finally, they score, and now you can open the game up a bit. Taken by Voracek. Great defensive effort with the stick. The Leafs gain control of the puck against the wall. Pass broken up. Boston's got it in their own zone. Here's a short pass to Zaka. Feeds it over to Smith. Poked away in the neutral zone by Segris. Boston's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Quick pass to Smith. Crisp's excellent play continues from his shutout in the last game. He's been sharp. And that's off a stick. He scores! They didn't sit back after getting that first one. They pile a back-to-back -back goal on here. Greer's injury has kept him out of the game. I just got word, James, he's not coming back this evening. Thanks for that, Ray. Let's see how the coach rolls with that now. Off the trot, he ties up his opponent. They put the puck into the offensive end. The Bruins get a hold of the puck along the boards. DeBrusque's carrying it ahead. The Leafs have it from their own end. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. And now it's grabbed by Pasternak. Quick pass across to Malkin. And he slides it quickly to Krizlik. Boston's got the puck at center. Takes the feed. The score! A Bruins goal! Here in the late goings of the period, the Bruins make their way back into the face-off circle, still in search of another goal. Taves wins it in the dots. Nice pass. Fires it. Oh, what a save by Olmark. Taves explores his options in the corner. Moves it quickly over to Hall. Oh, he's going to get called on that slash. And he takes a shot. That's off a stick. 16 seconds to go. Let's get the call here. There's going to be some carryover here, James. Good or bad, the next period's going to look a little different. will take to the ice for the first time tonight. The Leafs win the draw. Here's the chance. Oh, what a save in front. People excited as this opening period comes to an end. One of the all-time great rock acts from the 80s getting set to play here for these fans. We'll catch our breath. Back with more in a moment. They're ready to drop the puck here on period number two. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro, bringing you all the action. 
Boston's shorthanded unit gets off to a good start. They win the draw and take early possession. The Bruins have it against the wall. And that pass doesn't go. Poked away at center by Voracek. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Gets it out of his own end. Toronto's got the puck along the boards. Feeds it to Voracek. Receives the pass. Toronto's playing it from the side. Oh, a true warrior to block that. Toronto's got the puck along the wall. Dishes it to Voracek. Takes the feed. Cutting to the front of the net. Olmark's going to smother it to get a whistle. Can get dangerous if nobody's in control of the puck. Latang's not been able to get anything going offensively. You can see the frustration bubbling up on him now. Frederick's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. Big time blocker stopped by Olmark. Malkin's point streak has been a thing to behold. You start to get superstitious on a run. You do everything the same, you wear the same suit all the time. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. We got a whistle, penalty coming up. Penalty's called and right away the penalty killers stand up. They know the job is theirs to keep this game at a one goal deficit. Two man advantage coming up here. The biggest problem a five on three power play has is that everybody realizes what a great advantage it is. So everybody stands there waiting to shoot the puck. Nothing happens when the puck moves slowly. Here's a chance! Scores! And they convert with the man advantage! That power play is so dangerous. The puck starts zipping around. It ends up in one of a couple different options. They don't miss very often. Toronto's got an insurance marker here. They now lead by two in the second. Don't back off, though. Keep pushing ahead. Play the game in the offensive half of the ice. Boston's got a hold of the puck off the draw. Toronto's gained possession along the boards. Great pass from the left wing up the middle now. Johns already has a power play marker. You know on this power play, they're looking for more. And a tenacious effort pays off as he comes up with it. Quick feed to Coyle. The Leafs will play it in their own end. Johns is going to have to ignore the crowd here for the rest of the night. He was involved in that controversial play earlier in the game, which led to the injury for the home player. They're not going to stop booing him tonight. Hall's got it in the offensive zone. Into the corner. Moves it to Matthews. And he takes the feed. And a good one by Omar. And they get some breathing room as the puck leaves the defensive end. Toronto's got a hold of it against the wall. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. Boston's got it along the wall. The Bruins played along the wing. Puck set across the blue line. Can't make it work. Carlson's lugging the puck. Gains the zone from the right side. Oh, excellent use of the stick as he knocks that one away. Here's a short pass to Smith. Frederick's up and ready to join the play. Toronto's gonna play the puck from behind the cage. The Bruins get their man back or back to even strength. Well, the penalty killers can go back to the bench knowing they did their job. Score remains the same as it was when that penalty was taken. Hooked away in the neutral zone by Segris. Quick pass to Carlson. Oh, and a misfire as that goes right out of the zone. Scrum ensues along the boards. Boston's got a hold of the puck. And now he moves it to Frederick. Frederick. 
and he takes the pass. The Bruins pick up the puck here in the neutral zone. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Marner. Looks to pass it to Pasternak. Sends it into the offensive zone. Slides it diagonally to Latang. And it's broken up by a nice defensive use of the stick. Slides the puck to Carlo. With possession along the wall. And he had an answer with that save. Once he drops into that butterfly, he's pretty confident he's got most of the net covered. He slides across to make the save. Fantastic stick save by Olmark. Handles the pass from the right wing. The Bruins take it from the side. And he makes the save. Keeps hold of the puck. Musa quickly over to Nose. Denies him on the one-timer. Pushes it across to Riley. Stop. Oh, gets a blocker on it to turn it away. Effective save there. You make the stop, yes, but that puck's in the corner where there's no danger now. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. The Leafs scoop it up along the boards. Looking for space inside the D zone. Toronto's on the attack. Here he is, shot right in front. And play rolls on as he came up with a nice stop there. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. To the low slot. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. The Bruins cross the line and gain the zone. The Leafs take it along the wall. The Bruins get a hold of the puck along the boards. Moves it to the middle. And that goes off the body and a ride. Boston's in transition. Tries to get the puck over to Klingberg. Quick feed to Gostaspare. Turns it aside with the glove. Flashes the leather right in the slot on a difficult chance. Well past the midway mark of this period, the Leafs are up 3-1. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. And he takes the dish. Slides the puck down low. He scores! Jacob Boracek! The Leafs' offensive onslaught continues in the back half of the second. They're not showing any signs of letting off the gas pedal here. This has been a dominant performance. Toronto's won the draw. Moved up ahead here in the neutral zone. Makes the save as that goes off the glove. Omar's played poorly. The forwards and defensemen have played poorly. You can wrap a bowl around this one, James, and package it up. That's a bad night. Pass across to Carlo. Here they come, down the right side and on the attack. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. The Leafs have a hold of it in the defensive zone. They go on the attack through center. And now he angles it across to Latang. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. Denied that one. In tight, he had to make an excellent save. Slides the puck over. Here he is from the slot. What a stop with the paddle by Omar. They are really dialed in here tonight. Toronto's earned their place at the top of the league with an outstanding season. From the goaltender to the way they've scored, they are determined to stay on top. Here in the late going of the frame, Toronto's got a three-goal lead. Sends the pass over. Dumps it in. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. Moves it to Riley. And now he passes up to Johns. Here they come. Down the left side on the attack. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Johns. Great pass from the left wing. Boston's got a hold of the puck now. Couldn't make the connection on the play. On the attack into the offensive end, right up the gut. 
Now a quick pass to Pasternak. Poked away at center by Felino. And a strong physical collision on the play there. Moves into the middle. And that doesn't connect. Less than a minute to go here in the second. We got a stoppage as the puck sails over the glass. Officials getting ready to drop the puck to get play back underway. The Bruins win the faceoff. Puck scooped up by Malkin. Out of midair, he swats it down to the ice. Battle along the wall. Here's a short pass to Pasternak. Takes a bump, but still hangs on to the puck. Here's a chance! And he uses the glove to keep that out, getting a piece of it. All right, that brings the period to an end. Ray and Carlin both off to get some poutine from the concessions. I'm gonna grab some popcorn, and we're coming back with period number three in moments. One of your team players has the hardest shot. Who do you think is the fastest skater? We'll answer all of those questions in our skill. Period number three just moments away as the official signals both teams into position. Check our website out. It's been a total mismatch here as we get underway for the third. Let's see if anything changes. Ray Ferraro is between both benches. Ray, what do you make of the first two periods tonight? Toronto's focus now is just lock down this game. Comfortable lead. They've been terrific through 40 minutes. Don't give it away now. Quick pass to Marner. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Johns. Gives him a whack, and the officials are going to call this one. And the play is whistled dead. Here's the call. Marner Stickwork will land him two minutes for slashing. Boston sent in their power play unit out for the first time tonight. This is why you have meetings in the morning. You look at video of the penalty killers. You try to establish what their tendencies are going to be. Push the penalty killers into some place they're not comfortable. The Bruins gain possession along the wall. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Centering feed. And he denies that great opportunity there. Chance to reset here on the draw on this man advantage. Boston's won the draw. Takes a shot. Club saved by the goalie. Carlson's got the puck in his own zone. Sends a pass over. And they'll get it out of the defensive end. The Bruins have it now. Slides the puck ahead to Krizlik. Sends the puck across from point blank. Big save. As he slides in the butterfly, he's in great shape to make this save. And some good footwork to kick it away. The Bruins gain possession along the wall. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Fires it on net. Oh, off his club. He just got enough of it. Puck is cleared out of the defensive zone. The Bruins have it behind the cage. Krizlik stick handling in his own zone. Coyle's gonna play it against the half wall. And not much on that one. Coyle's got it behind the net. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. They get it out of the defensive end. The Bruins gain control of the puck. Right through center and into the offensive zone. Battling for it along the boards. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Moves it quickly over to Coyle. And he comes up with it. Covers it up and will get a stoppage in play. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. Toronto's been the better team, and the scoreboard shows it. 4-1 is where we sit. The Leafs win the draw. 
Got to give the penalty killers a lot of credit as the penalty expires. I like everything about that power play, James, except the fact that they couldn't put it in the net. Everything about it looked really good. The Leafs gain possession. Skates across the blue line. And that's knocked away in the defensive end by Lindholm. Sends one up to Krejci. The Bruins get a hold of the puck in their own end. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Puck grabbed by Latang. Quick feed to Marner. Oh, they had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. Moves it to Matthews. Knocked away in the offensive zone. And he takes the feed. Boston's got the puck against the boards. Turns it aside with the glove. Yeah, he's a sharp save, James. Right in the middle of the ice, he makes the stop and pushes it away. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. The Leafs lead at 4-1. Toronto's won the faceoff deep in their own end. And they fail to go tape to tape. On the attack, they come down the right wing. Moves it to the middle. Oh, and he keeps it here. Great reach by Taves. Toronto's got a hold of it along the wall. The Bruins have it in the offensive end. Big stop by the goaltender right in front. Those bang bang plays are just that. So quick. Puck on the stick, puck off the stick. The goalie's got to be in the right position or they're not going to make that quick save. Moments away from the faceoff. Let's get back to the action. Coyles won the draw. And he gets just enough of it to keep it out from the back of the net. The Leafs get a hold of the puck in their own end. Can't make the connection on the pass. Grabbed along the boards by Gostas Bear. Nice feed. Boston's got control of it now from their own end. Poked away in the neutral zone by Kessel. Boston's got the puck against the half wall. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Tracked that puck really well. The puck gets passed to the slot, and he has to make the save on a dangerous chance. Segris takes possession right off the draw. Good fight for the puck along the boards. And he coughs it up with the pass. The Leafs in transition at center. Pokes it away in his own end. The Bruins play it along the boards. Shot! Turned aside with a glove. Crisps on top of that one for a whistle. A little bit of traffic starting to form around the net. St. Louis is the squad they'll prep for next here, Razor. Yeah, the prep's already ongoing. Both the video coaches and assistant coaches are putting together their power play and penalty killing packages to show the players. But that can't be done until this game ends. It's an ongoing process. And that doesn't reach the net. And a great save. Gains the zone through the middle. Handles the pass. The Bruins move to the offensive zone. There's another for the hit parade. Scooped up along the wall by Fowler. And now he moves it quickly to Latang. From the right side, they gain the zone. Battling for the puck, but still hangs on. Slides it back to the blue line. Puts it on goal. Pad save. He's on it tonight. Feeds it on over to Smith. Big play inside the defensive zone. Played big in the moment there. And the puck's kicked free. Picked up along the boards by Fowler. Gaining momentum up along the side. Boston's got the puck. Sends it quickly to Pasternak. And that's broken up. Steps across the line and on the attack down the right side. Long jam in front, that's broken.
broken up. Olmark's going to hang on for a whistle. Past the midway mark of the frame, James and Ray with you tonight. The Leafs are giving their fans a lot to cheer about tonight as they lead it 4-1. Matthews has won the draw. They'll go to work offensively. Here's a short pass to Riley. Oh, what a stop! Taken along the wall by Pasternak. Slides it up ahead from the right wing. And that plays offside. We got a face-off coming up. Carlin Bay is standing by with who had the better night. Crisp's efforts have given this team a chance to win this game, guys. Given our matchup, it's hard not to give him the edge. Puck is dropped, and play resumes. Quick pass to Johns. Looks to set up at the point now. Made that stop. Centering in front, and that stopped. Olmark's gonna pounce on it, and he'll take the whistle. He's usually a pretty conservative goaltender anyway, and so the opportunity to kill the play, he's gonna take it. Here in the later stages of this period, Toronto's got a little more jump in their step tonight. They lead it 4-1. Picked up along the wall by Grislyk. Boston's moving the puck through center ice. From the point, they take control of it. Strong defensive effort. And here's a shot, and he rings the post. The Bruins are a pretty frustrated group. They've had plenty of chances tonight. I don't know how many times, James, they've rang one off the post there, and they just can't get back into the game. Look at that hit. Maybe try to wear down the opponents here. Right in front of the official's eyes, and the hand is in the air. Here comes the call. The Leafs are being called for tripping. Boston's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. The coaches have been on these guys to get more traffic in front of the goaltender. We'll see if they can do it. Camps won the faceoff. Trying to clear the puck from his own end. And a nice job by the Killers on that one. Yeah, now they can get a change, get some fresh players on the ice. From the open ice, they gain the line. And he regains control of the puck. And manages to clear the zone. Boston's got it behind the net. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. The Bruins are on the attack. Puck picked up by Klingberg. Looking to break out here on the power play. Approaching the final minute of regulation. Taken by Klingberg. From the back of the cage with the puck. Moves it quickly over to Johns. Turns it aside. Along the wing up the neutral zone. And that's intercepted by Johns. And the puck leaves the zone. The Bruins will get their other power play unit out here as they start from their own end. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Let's it fly and makes the routine save. Crisps on top of that for the whistle. Pretty quickly on top of it to kill the play. Hope everyone's enjoying the game here tonight. Another big face-off here on this power play. And a solid job tying up his opponent. The Bruins will play the puck from behind the net. The Leafs have it against the wall. Looks to start the transition game behind the net. Pass broken up. Hangs onto the puck. Scrum ensues along the boards. There's the final horn, and that'll do it here this evening. Ray, this was kind of a textbook team struggling right now. There's a lot of things you like, but they just seem to find ways to lose. It's amazing. When you're rolling along, you win games you shouldn't. And when you're losing, you lose games that you feel better about yourselves than the result. This might be one of them, but you've got to change the record here. Get to work, be a little more sharp, be a little more efficient. Otherwise, this streak continues on.
That'll do it from tonight's holiday edition. We wish you all a safe and Merry Christmas, and we'll see you after the holidays.